How would I describe my jewelry? You know, I just think I make really great personal jewelry that is simple. It's not jewelry that you leave in a, a jewelry box and you wear once a year at a gala or some fancy event. I'm making jewelry for the generation, my generation of young people who want to wear something great, something that is personal and has meaning. Jewelry just changes the way a woman moves. She can be wearing a dangler or a dramatic statement airing and she immediately transforms because she can feel the effect and the power that the jewelry offers or exudes off her. I was walking to Bloomingdale's and a woman had my earring on and I immediately knew that was my earring. For me, that's an accomplishment because for me, it's the everyday woman wearing the jewelry. Yes, it's great Michelle is wearing it. It's great Zendaya, who I adore because she's fantastic. Love it, but I prefer to see an everyday woman wear my piece because I think that is the reason I started making jewelry. I design very well in a well-designed space. This is why my house looks the way it does. It's soothing and it's calm in here. My mind is clear. I can sit down and come up with a whole collection in one sitting, you know. So again, my interior space all fuses with my jewelry design because I'm inspired when I walk downstairs. I'm inspired in the morning. I can walk in my garden and feel, you know, revived and inspired again just by looking and feeling. I'm self-taught, <laughs> so. Learning how to make jewelry was the challenge that I wanted to take. So craftsmanship was a whole process of trial and error. So, I mean, I have a full sleeve of tattoos now because the amount of scars I got from, you know, soldering and, and the polishing machine, I, I had to cover up all the cuts that I, that I got. Pearls are my birthstones. So that is the secret behind the brand. I always have on a piece of pearl somewhere on. So there's a little Baroque pearl on my chain, pieces that I love, just love, and they're a part of me now. The orbit ring was inspired by the Russian painter's work, Vasily Kandinsky, the painting is called Floating. So the pearl sits above on, let's say, an axis with the circle representing the orbit. That's how the ring came about. <laughs> For me, creating luxury fine jewelry is to make it timeless so you can wear it all the time. My woman should just feel empowered and strong because the jewelry that I make is simple, but it's also just like badass and timeless. <laughs> it's that simple.